But here she is to close out the night. Fro!
Which is all the time. I didn't say no. Oh, you didn't. <laughs> all, all, a lot of times. And I'm positive when you were a kid, you ate yellow snow. <laughs> I'm sure of it. Your girlfriend is so awesome, and so is your dad. Your sister's very pretty, but dude, your mom totally creeps me out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> true. But if I had a choice to take an 18-hour plane ride, I'd still pick your mom as my companion over Monica. <laughs> Tommy Snodgrass! <clears throat> Tommy's here, also from the FN crew. He isn't tall, but he does have pretty big shoes. He's very funny, that's for sure. His jokes really pack a punch. And if we're, if we're up... <laughs> if we're up <laughs> If it were up to Monica, she'd eat your dick for lunch. <laughs> oh, baby! Yeah. <laughs> or breakfast. <laughs> or... He's 20, Monica. Shut up. Like that ever stopped you before. Be quiet. Uh, you already got your chance. Be quiet. <laughs> Josh Winters. Josh Winters, spring, summer, and fall. If you're not doing anything later, want to go to the mall? If it's still there, we can climb that rock wall. I bet in your house you have a really long haul. And when you were a kid, I bet you played volleyball. And that has nothing to do with the fact that you're tall. You're such a nice guy. Not an asshole at all, like Monica. <clears throat> when is your birthday? I bet it's in the fall. You look kind of cold. You want to borrow my shawl? Did you know that I have an uncle? And his name is Paul. And he has a brother who is named Saul. And if you were from West Virginia, you would say, y'all. <laughs> Winters, splinters, splinters. That's all I got, buddy. Hey, at least your last name isn't poor. That's all I'm saying. There you go. I'm not boring. Shut up. <laughs> Jay Mills. Jay Mills. <laughs> Mr. Mills gets his thrills from writing jokes on windowsills. He works lots of jobs to pay all his bills, and probably also likes to take pills. <laughs> Just kidding, Jay. Pills are real bad. I know you don't take them, because you're a dad. Or maybe you do. I don't really know. But I'm pretty sure Monica does. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Michael Kalenich. Shut your fucking poor mouth. Nick 
Frango, the low life in the flesh. You wear the same outfit as Johnny Cash. But you're better than him, and we all know why. It's because you're Italian. <laughs> you can clap. seems an impossibility, a sloppy wet pipe dream, a big cheesy pizza pie in the sky. Holy shit, I miss cheese and I want to cry. No cheese for me, so I can't eat from under, but that's for your girlfriend anyway. But I'm sure if you play your cards right, you can get Monica to lick your toes. Because she's into that sort of thing. Yeah, baby. Malcolm Floyd, he left, but we're going to do his anyway. Malcolm Floyd, my favorite black guy. You write funny jokes probably from the can. And no, I don't mean jail. I mean the bathroom. Hey, have you ever made chicken stew? Fuck, I'm so hungry. You got any food? I know you got some chicken on you somewhere. <laughs> but anyway, <laughs> I hear jail is fun. You get to make bracelets and sleep on a bunk. So, Malcolm, have you met Monica? She's into bondage. <laughs> Jesse Huber. Jesse Huber, my next of kin. We're both Greek and Italian, and for us, that's a win. You're really like the brother that I never had. Your radio show is awesome, unlike your dad. But he was a Greek. Those guys are all jerks. But most of them look a lot like the Turks. Oh, boy, I love turkey. It tastes so good <laughs> with gravy and stuffing, those little cranberry thingies. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. Jesse, you should grow your hair really long, but not because you look a lot like your mom. Just do it so that you could too have a fro, and then I wouldn't be the only one making fun of Monica. <laughs> Aaron Norling. Oh, Aaron Norling, you are my friend. Everyone thinks you're crazy except Valeria Ben. <laughs> or maybe he does but who gives a shit just be yourself I think that's legit your songs aren't that bad I don't think they stink your impressions are funny and you always make me think this world is one crazy fucked up place just like inside Monica's pants and you would know that's right shut up Dex Grant of course I did Dex Grant, also black, with awesome dreads, tells jokes about smoking pot and his grandma's little kid. <laughs> I know Monica will like you because you're very tall. So be careful when you leave because she's going to try and eat your ass. Sometimes funny and you smell like a skunk. It's no wonder your wife kicks you out of the bed, makes you take a shower, and never gives head. You told me. But when I see you come around that bed, I think, oh, my favorite pervert. A friend to the end. Your liver is probably crying inside. Just like my stomach is from smelling all this awesome food. But I know that you don't drink as much as you let us think. It's part of your act. Wink, wink, wink. I got my information from a reliable source. Hey, did you know that Monica's getting divorced? <laughs> <laughs> Johnson. Hey. Dave Johnson, a teacher from YSU, super tall, likes to fight. <laughs> uh, funny jokes made me laugh, although you're new, but watch out for Monica because she's probably going to try and fuck you. <laughs> I love Lynn, by the way. <clears throat> Monica Bohr. Um, 
whatever I say bounces off of me and sticks to you because you're blue and stuff like that. <clears throat> Monica Bohr eats bananas galore. And I find it ironic that your name rhymes with whore. You stay out late drinking all night. It's no wonder your husband puts up a fight. When you come home, he screams and he yells, inspecting your holes for any weird smells. <laughs> Which reminds me, 
He should also stop doing blow. <laughs> of course, I'm just kidding, you silly girl. Look at my hair. Do you see a curl? Of course you do, because my name is Fro, and that is my poem. Now I gotta go. Entirely accurate.